did you like the most about the offense, and what are your biggest concerns? Yeah, what I like most is, is we can be very multiple. We, we got some guys that, that really understand what we're doing right now. Uh, we can move them around. Uh, we can do it out of different personnel, and, and that, that's something we came into camp. We want to run our offense uh, out of different, different, different looks, you know. And, and I think as an offense, we can control that and we can create them some conflict um, just by our personnel and what we're doing. Um, so, so that's been uh, very positive. Um, you know, concern-wise, honestly, we, we just got to keep communicating to each other. We talk about all the time, and in football, there are no secrets, right? And, and we got to talk football to each other. And as you go farther in camp and, and there's more defense installation and different looks, um, we need to play our game with our eyes, continue to do that, continue to talk to each other and um, understand how all 11 work together. And we got to play as one. Um, and I think that's something we, we've gotten better at, but we can still continue to improve of just, you know, playing with our eyes and talking football to each other. Where do you think Mike is at right now? I'm happy with Mike. You know, he's doing a good job. I think he really understands uh, what we're trying to do offensively and, and understands his skill set. Um, he does a nice job command-wise and, and IDing it and getting things lined up. Um, and of course, he's throwing the ball better, and, uh, which has been very positive. And of course, you know, he's explosive with his legs. So, um, like where he's at. What do you think are the challenges? You know, when you have a dual threat quarterback, but they're you know not taking contact in practice and then translating that to the games. Yeah, honestly, it's it's one of those you know all the quarterbacks would rather go live in practice. That's just as a competitor, but of course we have to be smart uh, with them. But that, that's something you know in practice when uh, he gets on the edge or he scrams a little bit, you re really never know if he's tackled or not. So uh, of course you know in, in practice you're you know call him down, and, and sometimes he gets frustrated with that. But as an offense, that, that doesn't really concern me, and, and we just got to play, and um, you know his, 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 the time will come when he's live. Do you feel like you've developed a little more depth at receiver? I do. I think as camp went on, um, there's a lot of guys making plays, and, and I was really excited. Um, you know, really different live periods of scrimmage situations we've had throughout spring, uh, particularly last Saturday. We, I think we went 107 plays or, or something like that, and a lot of guys played. And, and uh, um, you know, it, it, multiple guys stood out and made some plays, um, you know, vertically down the field, not just kind of, um, you know, uh, underneath stuff. So uh, that's been very positive, and I think um, we, we thought, you know, that that was a big part of fall camp. Is, 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 developing some depth there. We didn't have a lot of guys that played a lot of football, um, but definitely think that we've improved in that position. And you start Hawaii prep Thursday, but have you and the staff sort of started developing some of that game plan? Yeah, we have. You know, we really started honestly in the summertime, you know, just some summer prep, um, you know, getting a head start being game one. There's not going to be any new tape uh, to watch, uh, you know, throughout fall camp. So um, we'll get going and kind of revisit, you know, uh, our, pre our preliminary plan. Um, and of course, a lot will stay the same, but some will be a little different just based on our personnel, right? And, who, uh, who stood out uh, for us in fall camp and how we've grown as an offense and making sure we're, we're you know, putting our best 11 guys on the field uh, down in, down out. A little yeah, bit how of do you actually, like, how do you plan for them when there are so many, like they've had a ton of roster turnover, their coaches are all new. I don't think anybody knows even what formation they're going to have. <laughs> right. No, any game one, there's unknowns. There's no doubt. And this one's even uh, a little more rare just because, um, you know, total new staff and, and a lot of new players uh, in the program from, from their skill set. There's not a lot of tape uh, to watch on actually who's going to be playing uh, out there. But but honestly, game one, it's about um, you know controlling what you can control and, and, and playing your best football as a program, specifically as an offense. Um, and the good thing about you know uh, fall camp is um, you know just you know, see different things, different looks, and let the kids go play and react and kind of learn on the fly. So I think whatever they throw at us, uh, we'll be ready. With, with Ray, I you know he had the injury last year. Do you see him as 100% right now and um, like looking at that to be the bell cow there? Uh, he's definitely 100%. You know, he's had a great fall camp and, and uh, um, you know, we were excited to get him back out there. But yeah, he's 100% and uh, he'll be a big part of what we're doing. At what point do you want to have that right side of the offensive line set? And, and you know, I guess how much rotation could you go with in, like, in, within games? Yeah, you know, we're still, you know, working through that right now. We, we definitely have more depth than we have. Uh, we, 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 you know, of course, we'll have five starters as we set, get set for Hawaii, uh, but, but you'll see multiple linemen play uh, in Hawaii, and, and we feel good about that to keep them fresh. Um, so there'll be some rotation there. Um, I think that's important early in the season anyways, but honestly, the guys have earned it uh, up there, and, and the continuity's been good, and, and uh, so you'll, you'll see, you know, uh, seven, eight guys play.